Alright guys, so while we tried to transfer the data from our old iPhone to our new iPhone, we had this error. Also, there are certain people that are having problem with their pop-up is not coming on their iPhone and they're facing the same problem exactly what we had faced. Now, if you're having this problem, don't worry because in this video, we're going to go ahead and show you how quickly you can fix this problem and how you can just make this process work. Now, before you go ahead and check this main process, there are a few things you have to be careful with. First off, make sure that your iPhones are charged and at least it should have around 50% for your both iPhone but if you have less than 50% charged then all you got to do is to simply plug your iPhone into the charge to do that process so I'll just plug it in this phone since we have less than 50% charge on this iPhone now afterward go ahead and make sure whether Bluetooth and Wi-Fi turned on on your old iPhone or not and also make sure that you have stable internet connection on your old iPhone to make this process work Alright guys, the next thing you need to check is the software update for your iPhone. So now all you gotta do is just go ahead and open up your settings and scroll down to your general and now go ahead and tap your software update. And if you find the new software available for either of your device, now go ahead and download and install them to make this process work. Now afterward, let's say you have just checked all the software versions is okay and now you're ready to go. And the next things you've got to be careful with is very simple. And the next things you need to be careful with with your new iPhone. So if you see that, or if you have already set up your new iPhone, then all you need to do is simply erase your new iPhone to make this process work. Now, once again, go ahead and tap your settings and scroll down to the general and go ahead and scroll down to your reset options. And now go ahead and tap erase all content and settings once you've done that you'll get this pop-up and just go ahead and tap erase now and tap erase iphone and do it again now go ahead and enter your apple id password so i'll type our apple id password right here tap erase and once you've done that your iphone will take auto restart and your every single data will be erased now wait until your iphone get back to work Alright guys, afterward, your migration process will be start working and you'll be able to transfer all of your data from your old iPhone to your new iPhone. Alright guys, so we have a complete video about on how you can do that process. We will give you the video link in the description below so you can feel free to check it out. Alright guys, so these are the ways that you can try to do if you were having that problem. Alright guys, hope this video was useful. If so, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to this channel to get more useful video content for yourself. Thanks for watching and see you next time.